Hello and welcome back to Paper Mario! Oh, I'm so excited because this time we get to go to one of my favorite areas of the game! So cool! But first we have this little block with a sleepy sh sleepy sheep. I slit the sheet, the sheet I slit. Upon the slitted sheet I sit. Try saying that without swearing. Ah! And here we have the hammer throw badge. If there's like an enemy with a spike on top that's in the air and we can't hit it with our hammer, we can just use the hammer throw and throw our hammer at it. I don't think the hammer is usable for the rest of the fight though. Mario, I'm so glad you're okay! The town is in uproar. The princess kidnapped, the very castle uprooted, it's bedlam! I really don't know what we can do about all this. Please, Mario, save her highness. Sure thing, but this is Toad Town. This is the hub world of Paper Mario, and whoa. What is it? What? There's a little city inside the water. Okay, we're gonna disregard that and move on. But, oh, it's such a friendly little town. I would so live in a place like Toad Town. If I didn't, you know, if it existed, I don't, there'd be like cars and everything. Go down the pipe. If you remember, this is where our journey started. It's Luigi. I wonder what my brother Mario is doing right now. Whoa, Mario, it's good to see you. And you're all right. After all that castle craziness, I was really worried about you. I ran outside just as the earthquake started, so I managed to escape in time. Awkward introductions. Oh, and who are you? I'm Goombario. Nice to meet you. I see. Great. Just great. You're on an exciting adventure with Mario. Talk about unfair. See, someone has to look after this house, so I can't leave. Oh, well. Take care of Mario, okay? So Luigi's here! He made it out okay! But it's too bad he can't come with us. Nope. Mario has to go alone with his friends. Right now we only have one friend. Goombario. He's just a kid. We can't talk to him about adult things like Pokemon. We have our first instance of a shop here. Uh, I don't want to buy anything though, so we're going to be leaving. What do you have to say? Just one of the main reasons that I love Toad Town so much is that after each chapter in the game, they'll say something different to you. And the people are all so friendly, and they all have their own little story arcs, and I love it. What do you guys got to say? Peach's castle flew away. How could such a thing happen? What? What'll become of Princess Peach and the others who are in the castle? I'm scared. I'm scared. I, Felicity, am so scared. Yeah, they say things different that are more entertaining. Right now, the town is kind of in a state of panic. Boing. I think in this tree is another star piece. Oh, yes. And we can read the back of the signboard, and we can read the Toad Town Underground News. I'm scribbling on the back of a notice board. How naughty. I heard Mario was defeated by, Bow by Bowser. How ominous. A gossip-loving toad. Anyway. We were told to go to Shooting Star Summit, which is out that way. But I want to talk to the other people first. Because I love all of them. I think right over here, we have... Uh, nope, they're not done setting up their shop yet. But this is a... That's going to be a badge shop, where we can buy badges that'll help us out in our adventure. And there are one or two that I really want to pick up. This is where Peach's castle used to be. Were you? I can't believe that Princess Peach's castle was just here a little while ago. Wow. I was in the castle when it started to shake, but my lightning quick feet got me out. I know Luigi made it out along with a few others, but everyone else was taken. Well, hopefully we'll be able to do something about that. If not, at least we can have fun roaming around the world looking for a new home. Looking for a new princess. This one wasn't all that great anyway. She's mad at a paper. Ooh, hang on. Before we go to the summit, right over here is Mervly and Merlovely's house. I think. I don't remember what the names are. 
You. Tell me. Ah, my, my. I foresaw your arrival, Mario. My name is Merlovely. Lovely. I'm a stunning fortune teller. My noble calling is to read fortunes while looking absolutely ravishing. I can help you find it, you see. My twinkle star here will show me all that's hidden. My, my. Tell me, shall I read your fortune? Um, no. But this chest, look for it later. It'll come up. It's somewhat important, just a little extra. Help us out later on the road. But up here is, I think it's, this is just Merle. Merly. Mer Merville. Merlo of Shooting Star Summit. I collect star pieces. And he will trade us star pieces for cool badges. And there's one that is really important. That is the Peekaboo badge. We need ten star pieces for it. Unfortunately, right now we only have four. I don't know if it's possible to get this before going off on chapter one, but I doubt it. I off the top of my head know where I can get one more before going to the Cooper Brothers Fortress. But we'll get to that later. Right now the star spirits need to talk to us. Ah uh, yeah, we're gonna have another text wall coming up here. I'm gonna come up with different voices from people. Oh! Shadow Mario! We're evil! There's our fifth star piece. Only five more until we can get that peekaboo badge. Boing. Whoa! Ah! Ah! No! You don't know what's going on! Oh my god, the mountain's disappearing! Oh, jeez! Oh, 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 that just scared me! That, like, a legitimate Oh, man. Oh, this is terrible! Oh, no! Stop doing that! He's freaking me out! Oh! No! No! Oh. Welcome, Mario. We've been waiting for you. No, oh, man. We're the Seven Star Spirits. Our job is to grant the wishes of good people from our home in Starhaven, a place high beyond the sky. We're going to tell you something incredibly important. Please listen carefully. The other day, Bowser and his followers invaded our peaceful Starhaven. They stole our prized treasure, the Star Rod, which we've cared for since the beginning of time. The Star Rod is powerful beyond belief. It can grant any wish. For as long as we can remember, Bowser has been making wishes like, for instance, I'd like to trounce Mario, or I want Princess Peach to like me. Of course, stars ignore such selfish wishes. As a result, his wishes were never granted. Bowser, that fiend! When he found out we were ignoring his wishes, he came and stole the Star Rod so he could rent his own wishes. He seems content right now, mainly because he defeated you and captured the princess. Soon enough, though, I fear he will wish for more, and then terrible things will happen. It is the responsibility of the Seven Star Spirits to keep the Star Rod safe and use it properly. We must get the Star Rod back from Bowser and return it to his rightful place. Mario, we need your help. Sadly, right now you are not strong enough to challenge Bowser. He has made himself all powerful by making wishes with the Star Rod. He is terrible to behold. And since we seven star spirits are reunited in Star Haven, we can give you the power to fight Bowser even with newfound strength. With our help, you can prevail! In order to take the Sara back from Bowser and save Princess Peach, we need your help. Please, Mario. You are our last hope, and we will disappear. Mario! Looks like things are a lot more serious than I thought. You think the princess is gonna be alright? I'm really worried about her. Very unfitting music for that picture. Sniffle. Mario's probably hurt. Everyone's in prison. There's no bathroom in here! Something must be done. 
If only somebody could help me. Oh yeah, here we go. Cammy, you might want to avert your eyes. This could get ugly. It's no use waiting for Mario this time, my dear. We're so high above the sky right now. Even Mario doesn't have a chance of reaching us up here. Unless he finds a wing cap or something. You know, Princess, as long as I have this star rod, no one in the Mushroom Kingdom can touch me. You know that power that grants everyone's wishes? It's mine! Isn't that just wonderful? <laughs> I imagine what it's like down in your kingdom. Your subjects must be so upset because their wishes aren't being granted. How delightful. They deserve it for the way they've treated us Koopas over the years. If you, you know, want anything, all you need to do is ask me, princess. I can grant wishes. Of course, I'll only grant requests that I like. Anyway, think about it. You take care, Princess Peach. Enjoy your stay here. You watch yourself, princess. You better not cause trouble. You know, fire Princess Peach. I just wish for Bowser to be a really handsome and good-looking guy. That'd solve all my problems. Oh, please, if only somebody could help me. Princess Peach has a very masculine voice. Huh? Yes. I will now go even deeper. Hello, Princess Peach. Pleased to meet you. My name is Twink. But you're... you're a star kid, aren't you? How do you get here? I came from Star Haven to grant your wish. It's our job to grant wishes, you know. Oh. oh, you came because I wished that someone would help me. Yes, of course. Oh, that's just great. Thank you so much for coming. Here's my wish. Go right now and take that star rod back from Bowser, okay? Think you can do it? Uh, sorry, that's a little much for a novice star like me. Maybe one of the honorable star spirits from Star Haven could grant a wish like that. I'm so sorry. Please ask for something easy, like a, something a small star could do? Then can you take me away from here? Yeah, Mush! Everyone in my castle has been captured, and I have to save them all as soon as possible. Oh, I'm sorry. Can't grant that wish either, I'm afraid. Actually, I just got called up the, the sky a day ago, so I can't do big wishes yet. If I were a more splendid star, maybe I could actually help. It's alright. Don't be sad, Twink. Mario will definitely do something to save us all. He's probably coming right now! Oh, Twink. Do you think you can find Mario? I want you to give this to him. This is a lucky star, isn't it? Okay. Uh, it's a show that people watch! Okay, I'll do it. Princess Peach, I'll fly to the Mushroom Kingdom just as quick as I can. Oh, wait, Twink. Wait one second. Can you also... Please tell Mario that... I'm fine, and he shouldn't worry, okay? Can you tell him that? Of course! If you'll never do that again! Alright, so Peach is okay. And she's lost all of the color in her. Mario, where are you? 